Good morning. Today is Monday, April 17th. Our names are Melanie and Dave. And this is Friday Hi. Today. Today's schedule is 513. Now please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you and now for a moment of silence. You may be seated. Citizenship Pride Club meeting tomorrow. Students, please remember to order and buy your school sweater in the PTA store. Please remember that team shirts and club shirts can only be worn on Fridays. Golf practice Monday, Wednesday, and Thursday. Attention all 8th graders. Make your final year at Pioneer memorable and do not miss out on the spectacular upcoming activities. We have field trips like Red Venture, the Dinner Dance Graduation Party, and Field Day. Qualifications to participate in these activities are no dues or ups in conducts and academics, no dues in efforts, and no suspensions. Thank you, Ms. Martinez and the 8th grade team. Grand Adventure tickets will be on sale in room 56 for $140. We only have 150 spots. Don't miss out. Now to sports. It's just a 6 big league game. Miami Martins, JT Riddle, a ninth inning defense. Defensive replacement stepped up to the bat the play after Marco Ozuna gets thrown out onto the plate win the game and hits his first career homer giving the Marlins a 4-2 victory. The walk-off was the second of the series for a fish as they won three out of the four games against the Mets and now find themselves tied for the first in the division. And now to weather. Today's weather will be a high of 82 degrees with a 20% chance of rain and it will be mostly sunny. Not a lunch. Today's lunch is mini cheeseburgers, flatbread, pizza bagels, chicken, fresh fruit, broccoli, baked fries, salad, biscuit, and your daily juice and milk. And now to joke of the day. When a customer left his cell phone in a conference store, the cashier picked up, picked it up, and scrolled through the saved numbers, stopped at mom, and pushed sent. The mother answered, and she was told what had happened. Don't worry, mom said. I'll take care of it. A few minutes later, the cell phone rang. It was mom. Martin, she said, you left your, phone, your cell phone at the conference store. Not at this day in history. The Bay of Pigs invasion began when a CIA financed and trained group of Cuban refugees landed in Cuba and attempts to topple the communist government of Fidel Castro. The attack was an utter failure. The failure of the Bay Pigs cost the United States dearly. Castro used the attack by the Yankee imperialists to solidify his power in Cuba and he requested additional Soviet military aid. Eventually, that aid inclu included missiles, and the construction of the missile bases in Cuba sparked the Cuban Missile Crisis of October 1962, when the United States and the Soviet Union nearly came to blows over the issue. And now to the expectations. Students, please remember the school-wide behavior expectations. Be resourceful, ready, responsible, respectful, and healthy. Thank you, this has been Fire Today.